Howdy folks, Caribbean Decker, doing a little searching and detecting. Solid 22 on my knocks, and I see something round and green. Check this out. It's right there. Let's pluck it all together now. Oh yeah. Spanish copper. Queen Isabel from Spain. I think this is, yep, this is the uppers. And here's the side, the bust. Let me clean it out a little bit more and I'll show you guys what it is. Okay, here it is. I think it's an 1862 Spanish copper. It's what we call, what they used to call Maravedis or Maravedis. And I've detected this spot like, I'd say it a good 10 times. And I'd say like a good six or seven coppers have been covered this target from I mean, from this site excuse me and man I was like losing hope on finding something good today but persistence it's key on metal detecting all right I'll keep on digging and if something good turns out I'll show you guys cool I just want to make this quick video I was metal detecting a spot here in a beach and something just popped out of the ground. And I'm gonna look, I'm gonna take a look with you. It's not a live dig, but let's see what this is. It's heavy. I know it's Spanish. Hmm. Can't take a good look at it. Probably it's a Queen Elizabeth or Isabel. Oh yes, it's an eight Maravedi Queen Isabel. I think the second from Spain, 1800s baby. All right, not bad, cool. I'm sweating my butt off and I'm detecting on my favorite spot. I'm sorry, Austin, but I got to show you this. Deep down there, it was like almost eight inches. My Equinox was ringing solid 21, 22. And I'm sure it's gotta be, it's gonna be another copper of those. Yep. It's another one. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna roll. Oh, dude, look at that. I'm not gonna rub it too much because the green is gonna rub off if I do it a little bit hard, you know? But check that out, dude. 18. That's 1862. 1862 that's right sorry dude two coppers very good condition too let's keep home digging i've been here a lot of times i found here a lot of uh spanish silver cobs and stuff like that buttons um uh, i'm using my 
Equinox 800. Gave a pretty good signal, 17. And it was pretty shallow, actually. And, and it looks like it's going to be a button. Small button. I hope it had some details. Oh, look at that. Wow, that's pretty cool. That's that's a military button. It's a two-piece, of course. Um, this place never ceases to amaze me because you can find you can find like a lot of old stuff. Then you can find an iron patch. Then you can find the old stuff. Wow, this is this is cool. Totally unexpected. All right, let's keep on digging. Gosh, I love this hobby. Still detecting, walking around. Uh, I had this. Uh, it's a solid 22 on my Equinox, and I know it was going to be pretty uh, right on the top of you know on the surface, but not. Just check this out. I just poked it with my boot and look what it is. Literally surface fine and an old copper or bronze ring. It was just lying on the floor. Let me see if I can see some type of markings. It looks quite old. Of course it's not gold, but you just gotta love finding stuff like this. Must have been gold plated at some point in its time. But let's keep on digging. Well I'm still detecting, still finding relics and cool things. Always wear your glo uh, your gloves because you could get cut. I mean, it's not a big deal. It's not a big cut, but, you know, just be precautious every time that you go out and uh, do your diggings. I found this cool thing. Check this out. All right. It's been quite some time since I haven't found the D. The D, uh, D buckle, of course. <laughs> All right, let's keep on digging.